You can draw or print the online resource for this project. Use scissors to cut out the rings. Leave two of the rings whole. Make that the red and blue. First place the red ring below, then rest the blue one on top. Snip the green in two so you can weave it through the rest in a moment. You should follow this rule. The tying ring wants to be both lower than the lowest ring and higher than the highest one. You must weave the green ring to pass above the blue but below the red so meander your way between them. Now mend the cut on the green ring with a bit of tape. Check that the three rings are interlocked and hold together. The goal now is to verify that removing any of the rings disconnects them all, that you have not somehow weaved two of them together. We we'll want to remove a ring other than the green one to be sure. Cut the blue ring and remove it. And behold, proof the red and green rings were not tied together in any way by your weaving. To convince yourself, you can repeat the process and that time remove the red ring in the end and see that the ring lock is always removed whichever ring is attached.